Hey guys, Alice Mage here, and uh, welcome to a new segment of mine that making out of boredom, because why not? I actually did this way back when in 2014. I think there was like one or two videos, and it, it's just random reviews of things that I have purchased, have read, have played, have eaten. Basically, reviews of things that I've done in my life. Woo! Um, a lot of it's going to be books because I have three bookcases. And I'm home for another three weeks. Coincidence? I think not. We'll go through one bookcase per week. No, we won't. That's a. <laughs> That's a lot of books, guys. We're not doing that. But, we will do some. And honestly, I'm probably just going to, like, grab a book right now. And we'll just do this one. I hope this is the first in the series. Also, just so you know, I am not sponsored by any of the things that I'm going to review. Please do not think I am. Oh god, that was loud. Oh, I forgot Skype goes through my headphones and someone just messaged me. And it was just like, whoop! And I didn't realize how loud these were. Ah, I'm scared. I'm going to turn down my headset volume. Okay. We're good now. Now that I've wasted a minute and a half of your time, let's get to the actual review. I'm pretty sure this is the first one. I don't know. Dragon Quest by Donita K. Paul. It's it's part of a series. Um, I actually don't know how many books are in the series. I own four of them. Let's just grab all four of them. <laughs> the other books in the series that I am in possession of is Dragonite, Dragonfire, Oh wait, that wasn't Dragonite. Dragon Light. It rhymes with Dragonite. Cause the last one's Dragonite. Um, these might be the only ones. Oh no, there's a dragon spell apparently. That I'm not in possession of. I might have read that one through the library. Huh. Anyways. It's a it's a good series. It's about Squirrel who has to protect these dragon eggs, and there's cool pockets sewn in her cape that can blend in with everything. And honestly, I read these a while ago, why am I choosing to review them? But I remember it being a very, very good series. And I was like, oh, I need to get the other ones, which is why I bought the other ones. Like, years later, years later. And I was like, oh yeah, these are really good. And then I was like browsing around on the internet, looking up some forum sayings. There's a paladin in the series, he like helps save everyone. He like randomly shows up and is like, yo, I'm part of the light. I'm here to help you. Looking through forums and other reviews and stuff. I realized that this entire series strongly symbolizes Christianity. The paladin was Jesus. Spoiler alert. Um, and then, and then, I, that was when I was like two or three books in. I was like, oh, okay, okay. I, I never would have guessed that because I wasn't raised religious. I don't understand the illusions they made. I was just like, oh, cool. Ha ha ha, story. Um, and then as I was, I, was, I was continuing reading, I was like, this is very strongly Christian. How did I miss this before? And then I stopped reading them because of that. But that doesn't mean that they're bad. Like I said, it was a really, really good series. Probably for younger adults. Like middle school, early high school. But I mean, to be fair, I also read middle school and high school books now because, yo, stories are fun and cool, so why not? Let's just continue onward with the life and, you know, have fun with everything. Um, but yeah, so I would recommend the series. I would recommend the series if you are either as ignorant as me about Christianity and won't notice and me telling you now doesn't bother you, or if you are strongly Christian and you like fantasy or if you have a child that enjoys fantasy and you want Christian values and motifs brought into their literary world this is a great series like the main character is super brave and she's that small little 12 year old girl I don't think she's 12 I'm not exactly sure but like it is a really good series and I did really enjoy it um they're actually kind of long novels like let's let's open one let's open one it it is just like 400 pages, but this is what the font looks like and the spacing. It's so like, it's a good series. Would recommend. 
So, that's what these are going to be like. About five minute videos. Actually, I spent a minute and a half of this procrastinating, random crap. So probably like four minute videos. They're short, they're sweet, they're to the point. No, they're not. I ramble like crazy. Anyways, have yourself a magical day and I'll see you next time. Bye.